All right, guys, as I speak to you now, they just finished amputating Mr. Ibu's leg. Um, to be very honest, this is a very sad news because of a lot of things that have been open to surrounding how it led to this point where they had to cut the leg. Um, I would say in a summary that um, the man didn't have good people around him, down to family, everybody that was around him wanted to use him. Um, both friends, they all took advantage of him and then when he needed support, nobody was there for him, you know. A lot of things went wrong, a lot of times they would have gone to the right place, they didn't go to the right place. Um, a lot of things, I don't, it is not in my place to say something, but then again, um, Mr. Ibo should be expecting a, a statement from Mr. Ibo really soon. What I'm trying to say is, guys, put him in prayers, put him in prayers. He'll be needing support, not only financial support this time, but also prayer and love from the people that are his fans. <laughs>
So while we are still talking about Mr. Ibu, let us do well to reach out to that man. And as for Mr. Ibu, like I said, you will be getting a statement from him very soon. Please, guys, put him in prayers. And then, like I said, you'll be needing all the support he can get, the financial support, prayers, and everything. I'm just trying to imagine how that man will cope. Like, man, just three months ago, you had legs, and then now you cannot, <laughs> you don't have legs again. That means he can no longer do some type of movies anymore. He cannot even go to set again. He can't do movies again. <laughs> it's like, be careful people that are around you in life, for the people that you've been close to you. That's just life. A lot of things will be unfolded very soon. But like I said, it's not in my place. Let's wait for Mr. Ibu and then, peace guys.